Hello everyone. <coughs> I'm an official online and I'm in Russia. And in this video I just want to give information to catch catfish, Welsh catfish and Burbo and Zander at night time here in Russia. Alright, so the first thing of the catfish, the Bobo and Zanders, they are only active at night. You target them at night time. The locations is deep holes. You can check the deep holes here at the camp, close to the camp if you just go across. Or you can come all the way up left, left of the map, this deep hole here, where I'm currently sitting at. Or you can even go further upstream in these deep holes. Upstream here uh, is where you can target your catfish and your bobo. I have the most success this spot I'm currently sitting at now. Here, right on the corner of D5, D and E5, right on this corner. And I also have some good success down here at the camp at this big, big um, deep hole here. I also have some good success on the catfish on the zanders. Now setups firstly for the catfish. Um, you can use <coughs> size hooks too. Number two hooks with frogs. The frogs work, works fairly well for the catfish here. You can also use the leeches. Also in size two hook. And you can also use the big baits. If you want to craft big baits, this bunch of giblets. And they are also very, very good for the catfish. Now on the frogs. You will also pick up some Zander at night. Um, it won't happen very often, but you will, will pick up some Zander as well on the frogs. Then on the leeches, you can pick up the catfish, the burbo, but you will also pick up sometimes um, the normal bream that you will pick up on the leeches. Just cast it right into that 5 meter hole. Then on a spinning option primarily for the Zanders, you can use a size 1 jig head or a size 2 jig head on your spinning rod. And you can use the twist knot 2, 7 gram twist knot 2 is the one I have the most success with here. You can even go a bit bigger, you can go to a jig head number 2 and the twist knot knot number 3, the biggest twist knot um, but then your bite rate will definitely come a bit down. You will increase your chances of catching bigger zander but your right bite rate will slow down. For the Zander, I usually do a slow 25 speed steady retrieve with a jig, just a jig of the rod every one second or so that I do for the Zander. And then we've got a little Zander. Now, these, these targets I find handy. Um, because catfish and the burbo, neither of them pay very well. But if you arrive here at night and you just want to do the daily of the lake, then the catfish, burbo and the zander is a good option. 
because um, they can sometimes take a while to bite but if you get a good night and you get uh, quite a few bites quite a few catfish then you can finish your daily quests rather quickly because um, in the night time your usual your usual well paying fish like the sterlets they are very quiet at night we got another little bow on this twist knot jig you will, you will stand a chance to catch some bows as well even sometimes the odd catfish will bite on that little jig head Zander on the leeches as well. On both on both your frog rod and your leeches rod, you can pick up the zanders as well. <coughs> this feels like another catfish. Or maybe a good boat. So yeah, this is a I usually do this um, when I come to Russia for the daily and it happens to be night time then this is my go to targets Then I target the catfish, the babo and the zander to make quick progress on the daily because there isn't really any other big fish during the night that you can target to make proper progress on the daily it's another nice babo so when I, I arrived here it was about midnight, so I'm only busy now for about two and a half hours in game, and I'm already almost finished with my daily. I only need six kilograms more of my daily, so that is what it is very effective for. You can, if you want to. You can only do the lure with the twist knot jig and only catch the zander. That's the better XP and the better money. That is completely up to you how you want to do your night time here. As far as sizes goes, um, if you look at the current lake records, um, the wells catch, they do get big here, especially if you use a bunch of kiplets. They do get up to it's the current record 36 kilogram. So use proper rods, um, don't use rods that's too light. Your bows is up to around 8 kg and your zanders is up to about 5 kg. So plan your the strength of your gear accordingly. I usually, my two bottom rods that I target the catfish, I usually use 30 kg rods. But <coughs> I only I never use the giblets. I only use the frogs and the leeches, so I never really catch massive cats. But the massive cats can take the normal frog or the leech. So just make sure that you don't target them with too light gear, otherwise you might run into problems. Oh, 
as plot. And there my daily is all but done. Almost done in only around 3 in-game hours. My daily is almost done even before it's going to become daytime. To target the sterlet, the daily is already going to be done. So that's it for this one guys. I will see you in the next video. Cheers.